It's been a tough week, gentlemen. We've lost more than we ever dreamed, but we will recover. I've got a blank check, and we're gonna use every cent of it killing Makarov. Despite what the world may say, we are not savages. We don't kill civilians, we use precision. There's an evil man hiding in these shadows, and we're gonna bring him into the light. Once his face is revealed, we will write history, gentlemen. These are the last safe havens left on Earth for Makarov and his men. Sounds like we've got to be in two places at once. Impossible? Not for the 141. 50 50 chance to take out Makarov, eh? Captain Price, request permission to take the safe house with Roach. Granted. Soap and I will take the boneyard in Afghanistan. Very well. We will cut off all avenues of escape. This ends now. Strange. Could have sworn we ended this war yesterday. Snipers in position. Strike team go. Engage Makarov on site. Roger that. Solid copy. Hello guys, it's Games Guys and Review saying Mega, and right now we're playing Modern Warfare 2. And in the beginning here, you're gonna have to walk to your left. Walk to your left, and um, when you keep going forward, and you're gonna go to the forest. There's gonna be some landmines actually gonna be going up into the midair, and uh, you have to play how low you can you go. So you actually have to crouch, and they actually go slow mo for you. So you actually have some time to do it. But um, as soon as you go out of the slow mo and uh, you get you get control again from the dizziness, you're gonna see a lot of enemies in front of you. You're gonna see a lot of people on your left in the area on the cliff. And they have RPGs, they have um, grenade launchers, blah, 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 they're gonna kill you really quickly. So you wanna get out of this, their sight very fast. So I usually found it really helpful going this back area here and um, make sure there's nobody shooting at you. And if there's somebody around in the cliff, uh, get them quickly. And after you get them quickly, oh, uh, sorry, troubles are getting there, but after you get them quickly, you have to approach in the smoke area. And there's gonna be more guys over here, and uh, it's kind of tricky, especially since you don't have any shotguns, you don't have anything um, uh, close quarters, so you have to make sure you uh, you're careful. And and uh, when you get inside, there's gonna be a lot of guys. Um, try sticking by your your friendly AI because they can pick somebody up if they, you don't see them quickly. Um, the shadow in this game and the um, the physics is pretty good, so there's nobody, you know, gonna be hiding too bad for you, so you're gonna notice them. However, you wanna be careful and throw a couple grenades, maybe some flash grenades, in order to avoid getting killed really easy. So, in this point here, I, I think I get an SMG, I get the ump, and I grab it any moment, any moment, and I got it right there. And the ump is pretty good, especially since they were really close to me. And uh, you want to keep going for the, for the checkpoint right now. And this part of the mission really is really easy because you just really uh, breaching to the the house, and you have a lot of friendly and people. Um, the hard part is gonna defend the house. We'll get to that in a moment. We got two trucks leaving the target building. And you're sipping around, sipping around, sipping, sipping, sipping. I'm sure we're fast on. Huh? Well, anyways, um, I forgot. Even though I played this already. Uh, I think this is my second or third time playing this level. Um, I keep shooting at the trucks even though I know they're bulletproof. <laughs> you can't do anything about it. Um, um, they actually have somebody with the javelin, which is pretty cool. The way they do it. But um, After they're gone, you have to breach in one of the three en entry points. And I usually go to the left one. I don't go to the front one because it's a little bit harder. And I'll go over there in a second. But now there's going to be a couple guys by the jeeps in front of the house. And you use uh, your flash grenades and stun grenades if you have any, and just uh, quickly go in there. And I think I just noticed really easy. Um, <coughs> most of the times you use a stun grenade or a, sm a smoke grenade, uh, your friendly AI they're gonna go quickly in there. So if anything, you use one and they'll go inside there and clear the way for you. So right now you're doing um, a breach and clear. 
So you just get the guy in the front of you, and there's one guy to your far left who's going to, you know, try to get you. And um, after you get those guys, there's going to be more guys running to you. So you want to make sure you're careful with that. And there's going to be like a room in the back, like an office type. And either Ghost, who's the person in the first door, is going to take them out. Or you have to take them out. So you gotta, you got to be careful. So right now, you have, as you can see, there's a lot of goodies, a lot of weapons in this area. And there's a lot more in the whole, you know, whole building, the house, whatever it is. But right now, you have to... Um, keep reaching to these different areas and there's more guys up here in the second floor there's more guys in the basement and um, the way you gotta do this one is kinda tricky and you can get killed really easy and um, the best way I found it is to grab the striker shotgun which is always gonna be there with that guy that you killed and um, kill these two guys over here in the back area with the shotty and it should actually penetrate through any box and desk and whatever and um, as soon as you gain, gain control, just go in the back a little bit, just back out. And your friendly person is going to be able to take them out really, really quickly. So as you can see, everything's out. Nobody in there. So you want to go to the basement area and um, reach the other two areas. And you got to be careful though because um, there's a guy in the far back. As you can see right there. Yep. And after you get him, you have to breach in this door right here there's two doors actually and you have to do both of them which is really overdone in my opinion and after you get those two guys um, it's gonna be clear so you're gonna go really easy that's three guys actually <laughs> so in this area here is gonna be more shotguns there's gonna be more um, silencer on the weapons which is pretty cool but um right now we'll explain in a different video what kind of weapons you need and you need more assault more heavy duty and really up close kind of weapons because um in the end everybody except you and ghost are gonna get killed so you want to have the best weapons to encounter enemies up front and uh, you'll be able to defend yourself so right here you have a and like ammo crate uh it gives you infinite ammo and it's pretty good so you can pick any weapon you like any gun and then just get the infinite ammo for it and um, after you do that you you can actually uh, start putting claymores around uh, right now you have 10 and uh, I'll show you in a second or two uh, where's more claymores right there in the corner I'm not sure you saw them but there's a lot more claymores over there so after you put all the claymores around the first floor you want to go back there and keep putting more in the second floor and this in the top floor and the reason you're gonna do this because uh, any moment now you're gonna get swarmed by a lot of enemies and uh, it is the best way and just put them around like randomly really and like entrance uh, way you, uh, anywhere you can see from the outside inside uh, put a claymore too because it's gonna be a lot of enemies going to you so as you can see now I'm just getting the remaining claymores and going to the second floor I'm putting more up here in the stairs uh, to the porch and you want to spread them out evenly and not too close because if you put them too close they will all blow up at the same time and um, put them up here in the, the jeep and outside in the porch and areas and um, anywhere really anywhere you know there's an enemy gonna come to you uh, pull one right there corners anywhere I'm telling you right now it's gonna get really hectic in a second so anyways this is games guys and reviews I am mega rules so come and watch the second part see you guys